A provocative billboard gains lots of attention <laughs> in New York. Yes, and a bug bite forces a man to make some dietary changes. Cody, standing by with the news of the weird. News of the weird. Let's get weird, man. All right, a man in Nashville, Tennessee, is now allergic to red meat because of a tick bite. <laughs> I'm eating Chris, my yogurt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I Chris <laughs> Aox from the, the Nashville Aox was bitten by a Lone Star tick about six months ago. Aox went about his life and everything was fine until he had a deadly allergic reaction in December after wow. a particularly meat heavy breakfast. Oh my goodness. Afterwards, an allergist diagnosed him with alpha gal syndrome, which uh, makes him allergic to any red meat. AOC says his allergy has led to some lifestyle changes. Technically, alpha gal syndrome uh, causes a person to be allergic to uh, carbo carbohydrate that's found in meat that comes from any animal with hooves. The good news is that for the most people, the syndrome goes away with time because you know, I lived in Nashville. It's, it's tough not to eat meat in Nashville. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Mr. Aog's gonna have a tough time. It ain't like California where you got right. vegetables and stuff. <laughs> no. All right, the biggest Damn. thing to come out of Paris Fashion Week is no bigger than the palm of your hand. The Jacquemus Meli Quito bag had the fashion world in Wait. a spin last week. <laughs> That's it's only ridiculous. two inches long and smaller than a credit card, so it's really only capable of holding like a few mints, maybe a house key. It's, it's actually point. a mini version of already tiny purse that the company released last year, which retails for five hundred dollars. <laughs> no word under this smaller statue of the new version will be half or double that price. It's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> five hundred dollars? You can't put anything in it. We belong to the lollipop. Uh, before we show you this next story, take a good hard look at the picture because what you see at a glance is not what you're actually seeing. You ready? A billboard advertising divorce services in Albany, New York is raising some eyebrows. It's an ad by We the People <laughs> with, <laughs> with an offer for divorce services for just $499. That's it? That's not the middle finger, though. Look again. A local TV nice. news viewer it alerted sure the not. station about the billboard, saying Definitely it was disrespectful and made light of something that tears family apart. But a survey of people living and commuting nearby <laughs> found that no one was offended by it. It's just, it's funny. Matter of fact, most people got a kick out. I'm getting a huge kick out of that. Yeah, that's funny. I, I, I know those people that call the TV station. They get offended by things. Yes, and they, they're very upset. Uh, that was funny. All right, uh, that's your news of the weird, 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 weird. weird.